But a lot of times the questions that I get from you, and I get thousands of them, okay? The way the question is worded, I can already understand part of the problem. The people who come to me and say, why is it that your prophet was 53 years old and he had sex with a six-year-old girl? How many of you heard that question? Too many. How would you answer the question? Who would like to try to answer that one? Anybody? You'd like to answer it? Or you think you can answer it? I wouldn't like to even talk to the person after they said that. You notice what's wrong with the question? It has mistakes in the question. First of all, it's not six, it's nine. How many of you noticed that? But you know how they did it? It's real easy if you know Arabic. You change the literal letters to English, tissa was sitta. Same letters, just switch them around. You can fool somebody who doesn't know. Sitta, tissa, nine, six, no difference. <laughs> Peace of Christ to all. Let us show you all how big fat liar you are and don't, you don't respect your age. Shame on you. What a big fat liar you are. Simply, this is how the number 6 in Arabic and this is how the number 9 in Arabic is. How you can change them to make the 6 9, you're ignorant. Secondly, it is not us who is saying that, you ignorant liar. How you can lie, you know, you call, those Muslims, they call him a scholar and they have him in a TV. Well, isn't it this? Your book saying in Sahih al-Bukhari that she was six and he was married to her at that age? Is it us? Do Muslims have a shame? Isn't it shame on you to be in TV and the Muslims consider you a scholar? So we are the one who changed the number 6 to 9? And is it written in the hadith 6 as number or written as word, you liar? And isn't it this your book or this is a Christian book? Sometimes I ask myself, how fat Muslims get by their lies? I think they are very heavy in weight. And look, he is trying, you know, he is playing the comedian. Like, you know, what do you want to say, you know? First, the question is wrong. She was not six, she was nine. Look, you know what? He's correcting it. As if nine, she is an immature woman. You see, now he is making it better. The hadith says clearly that he did marry her at the age of six, and right away she moved with him. And even Muslims, they say to you, some of them, they say, yes, she moved, as the hadith says in here. After three years... Khadija died three years before the Prophet departed of to Medina. He stayed there for two years. So three years, in a three years, Muhammad, he left the Medina. Three years after Khadija's death. And he did marry to Aisha when she was six of age. And by the way, six of age in Islamic calendar, it means she, is, she was five. Because the Islamic calendar is the moon calendar is shorter than our year. So if, she, if the Muslims consider her six, it means she was five going into her six. She is not six yet. And he have intercourse with her when she was nine. Between the six of nine to nine, he was doing what? He was doing molestation. He used to put his private part between her legs. But if we go with his lie, saying that, you know what? She was not six, she was nine. The, Muslim, the Christians, they changed the, the, the letter as if the hadith written as a letter, or sorry, as, 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 as a number. Do, don't you see it? Does it say there a number or it says a word? Is that a number or it's a word? How you can change it? And this is your Islamic side, and those are your books, and this is Sahih al-Bukhari. Liars as your scholars. 
So if you consider yourself a scholar, I consider you a liar. And I consider the one who is proud about you is mental because you have to be mental to believe in a mental and you have to be a liar to listen to a liar. Follow with me with the coming video. Christ is Lord. Amen.